Alright, welcome back guys to another episode of Zord's Battle Legends. We're gonna start the Chaotic Century Tournament, but first, let's enter some cheat codes. Now you're thinking, Zaki, th there's no password system here, and there's nothing like that. How are you entering cheat codes? Well, you go to the config, and you go to voices. You go to voice, and you enter in... Hold on, I'm gonna... Hold on, gonna change something for a second. Alright, back again. Okay, so the first one you're going to want to enter is 004 uh, dash 044 dash 019 dash 066 dash 034, which should enter on the, on the screen at the moment. Or should have been. Um, and you have to go up to it and click it, or hit the A button. My and technique is first rate. these are just uh, voices from the game, as you would think. Leave it to me. Um, and that will unlock one thing, and then we go to another one. Kind of want to make sure you exit and then come back in, just just to make sure that you got a little bit of room in between each one. And go back to config. We have two codes to enter in right now. So then we're gonna go back to voice. It's still on 34. So then. Go back, and the second code we're going to want to enter is 021.001.087.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.
Trian Fury? It's one of those. Berserk Fury upgrade, basically. Um, because th those are really fun to use. But I'll go with the Dark Spiner because who doesn't like a dinosaur? Um, but there are a couple Zoids after you beat the. Uh, after you beat uh, one of the places that you can use. So, I'll use that when that comes up. But for now, we're going to use the Blade Legger. I think it's the last time through this episode. Or, this whole episode, you only see me using the Blade Legger. But, it, it's still the, uh, the Blade Legger. If you want to see me use a Zoid, you can suggest it in the comments. Um, if you're in game anyone, this will be, because I'm not a director yet, this will be uploaded after it's all complete, so don't post any comments and stuff you want to see. Unless you want to see stuff for, uh, for, uh, versus later. Um, YouTube, you can comment on what you want to, if you want to see any. Um, but yeah, we have Rosso and uh, we have Rosso. Blah, blah, blah. We have Rosso and Viola, which Viola has a problem with the Blade Legger, or doesn't have a problem with the Blade Legger, because the Magla can actually sneak under the blades because it's so short. So you have to take her out with like the uh, some other means, or let Rosso take him out. But then you got Rosso and the Red Horn, which. It's actually quite difficult if you're just going off of of what they give you at the beginning. He's actually quite difficult. But having a blade lagger front is 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 actually pretty good. Trying to run away to let my partner actually get the, the KO, but then that didn't seem like it was gonna happen. Or does it? Wait, wait, wait! Shield bashing for the win! I always like doing that. <laughs> I think after that, I was like, I just beat him with my shield. I'm gonna see how many times through the pl <laughs> for the Chaotic Century tournament I can do that. So you'll see that a little bit later. But that's Rosso and Viola! You don't actually get to see them as they're, let's see, what were those called? It's flying things with blades. That were like albatrosses. Because there's no flying zoids in this game, which is sad. But zoids that fly. I'm looking on Google right now. Um, Rosso and Viola. But anyway, the next people we have up is, uh... Van and Fiona, number one, and Moonbay, or Moonie, <laughs> as they call her in this. It, it's Moonbay. It's Moonbay. So, let's see. We're also... Storm Sorter! That's what they're called. Don't actually have Storm Sorters in this game, which makes me really sad. Cause storm Sorters are awesome. Anyway, Van and Fiona number one have a shield legger, like they do on the show, and Moonbay is going to be using a a, a Gojulus. Going to be using a go. Gustav, which are actually very defensive but are really weak. Cause when you get one, they only have a thousand HP. So, keep that in mind. Unless you're a collector person, then go ahead and get it. I was a collector person at one point, so I understand. Just kind of one of those things that are like, I must get purchase all of the Zoids. Uh, main thing to do is take out uh, Van and Fiona first. And then take out Moonbay and the Gustav. And the Gustav also has mines, keep that in mind, because mines hurt. Mines hurt a lot. And Ivan is being a prick and not really helping. I mean, he's, he's kind of helping fighting Moonbay, but not really. Let's... 
Trying to show off the blades just a bit more. Didn't quite use them enough. More jumped in, rawr, rawr, stabby stab, up. Which I would have finished them off with that. That kind of throat lunge. And that was a pretty good move on their part. Ready? Is I gonna shield bash him? No, I'm just gonna shoot him in the head. Yep. Shoot him in the face with the guns. With the, uh, the super cannons. That was really a wonky range. I get hit by that so much in this. And the Gustav is actually a tad bit faster than I remember. Like, it's not actually fast, but the jump that it does, the skip, the tactical dodge, whatever, helps it a lot in this and actually doesn't let me get a actual round to get, like, good damage off on her. And Ivan, being a prick that he is, isn't helping. That's why I think most of the time this game is a solo game, even though they give you a partner. Partner really does not do much. Unless you give him a bulky zoid. <laughs> but you only want to give him a bulky zoid so you get more money. And hopefully they stay apart from the fight. Or do a little bit of distracting. What did he get hit by? Did he like run into the mine? And I'm doing this because this seemed to work for the Lord Gale that I did before, so why not work now? Except for she's getting too close too quickly, and the rockets aren't smashing into her, and she's too short. They can't do much. Although I did definitely drag this fight out a lot longer than it needed to be. But here we got a rain of missiles! Rain of missiles... Nope. Must have come down too... Slow. There we go! I haven't actually got the kill. Although he ran into the landmine then, cutting our pay. <sighs> Stupid Ivan. But anyway, that's the last match that we'll have for this video. Um, we'll have the excerpt to the next battle at the end. See who our next opponents are. <laughs> wonder who they are, wonder who they are. Actually, I know who they are. Um, Obviously, this is a post commentary, so I've seen them before. Um, Please wait for the next battle. I am Zaki Ray Chakum. Suggest any Zoids that you want to see if you're on YouTube. If you're on Game Anyone, just ignore that message, because this is going to be posted when it's complete. Next time, we'll battle Raven and Carl Schwartz, both with Zaberfangs. But anyway, I already said I'm Zaki Ray Um. But tune in next time for more episodes of Zoids, Bat or Zoids Battle Legends, and have fun gaming.